Hi, so it's uh, Richard G6HKS. Um, a few people have asked me to uh, run a um, show the sun noise on my uh, EME array. So I've got four 18s WS718562s, so that's 20 DVDs of forward gain, very low noise uh, pattern. I've got a VHF design uh, 20 dB 0.4 noise factor. Um, uh, LNA. Uh, main rig here, as you see, is the FT847. So I'm currently in a quiet part of the sky. The S meter is just the odd one bar just popping up and down at times. What I'm going to do is I'm going to peak the antenna at the sun, which you'll see, and then using a trilithics notched attenuator, I'm going to step it down until I get the same reading. The difference being the attenuation that you need, and therefore that's your sun noise. Uh, measurement and again it's a good per indicator of how well your antenna uh, system is performing so without further ado let me get the uh, antenna onto the sun which I'll do now while holding my phone so I know it's about 16538 so it's the um, it's the 11th of March today Solar flux is 68, so the sun is not very active at all, really. Right, so 38. So we'll soon be on this. You'll see the difference as we get onto the sun. There we go. Now it's obviously a bit tricky. I might let me try and absolutely peak it. So this is the... Uh... Right, okay. Okay, right, so now let me just quickly show you the attenuator. So we've got here a trilithics notched attenuator, and I'll show you that, and there's the uh, step. So look, I'm just going to start to uh, step that down. Tricky to do. <laughs> right. So I'm starting to step it down now. So we're currently at uh, 2 dBs, 3 dBs, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8. Now I'm going to go to sub 8.1. So today we're seeing 8 dBs of sun noise. Uh, funny enough, I, I tested this just before doing this and uh, I actually got 8.7. Um, the sun might just have moved into the tree, so I'm getting a bit of a, a bit of a, a extra loss there. However, for a system of, of this size, uh, that's a very, very good performance. And probably explains why I can have um, uh, single Yag QSOs with single Yagi stations in good conditions and also hear my own echoes down to about 30 watts at the, pa at the power splitter. I'll show those uh, on another uh, video. Let me just take it back to take all the attenuation off then. So hang on a second. Oh, hang, actually hang on, let me see, you can see. 
So I don't know how well, yeah, you see 8 dBs. So if I step that back, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. So we can also see that on the FT847, it's about S3, it's about 8 dBs. I'd have to look at the manual. Normally it's flicking one bar above the three, but hey, whenever you do a demo, it never quite works out, does it? Anyway, I hope that's a bit of help, and, uh, and you can certainly see how you can uh, see the sun noise uh, with a, uh, a good system. And a single Yagi, you, you'll get a, a reasonable response as well, I would expect. Okay, hope that's a bit of help. Thank you.